years, five years actually, I worked for three different employers, um, project management, development work. I had a lot of interaction with other people that were working in the area, and I, I just noticed several foreigners, Westerners like myself, who really spoke Arabic very well. They were speaking Arabic fluently, and I thought, wow, that's amazing. My programs, they provided interpreters for me. The interpreters were funded, and I always had uh, someone next to me in meetings or with me in the office to translate documents or read documents to me. And as I, but I observed these other foreigners, these Westerners like myself, they were speaking Arabic themselves and they could read contracts or documents. I really felt like if I wanted to be most effective, that I should also be able to speak Arabic and read Arabic like these other foreigners. I asked them, I said, where did you learn uh, how to speak Arabic? And they all said, Kelsey Arabic program, Kelsey Arabic program, Kelsey Arabic program. It never failed. The people that really uh, could speak it well had been here to the Kelsey Arabic program. I filed it in the back of my head. I said, man, if I ever have the opportunity to learn uh, or, or have the time and uh, save up the money to go to the Kelsey Arabic program, that's what I'm going to do. So finally, uh, I did that. But not before I tried to learn it on my own. So I guess when I first came to the region, I thought, well, I'll be immersed, you know, I'll, I'll be surrounded, and I was. I, I was surrounded by Arabs. At one point, I had more than 200 Arabs in the office where I was working, and they were, you know, they were around me. I was, as we say, immersed in the language, but uh, it wasn't working. I thought I would study on my own, and I did. I had two books, um, two really good books that I had picked out that were uh, about Arabic language, and I studied it, particularly when I was not working. In the evening times, I sat with colleagues or I sat with friends in the neighborhood. And I had my two books and I would study. And I still did not get fluent. But it was clear to me after four or five years, I needed a uh, structured program. I needed to devote myself full time to the, to the language learning. That's what was clear. By 2010, I had saved up enough money and um, decided it was time for me to come learn Arabic language so that I could continue uh, doing relief and development work but without having to use an interpreter or a translator. Now that I've been out of the program for a few years and I'm, I'm, I'm still living here in the Arab world and I'm speaking every day to Arabs, um, it's interesting to reflect on how the Kelsey Arabic program actually helped me learn. So. Some of our curriculum books are called patterns, and some of our classes here are called patterns. I, it's, it's, it's appropriate, in my opinion, because there are these patterns in the language. When I'm in the Arab world speaking Arabic and listening to Arabic, even though I may not have ever heard the word that I am listening to or uh, hearing thrown at me, I can hear the sounds of the word and because I know the pattern and structure of the language, because that's what I was taught to learn here, then I know what they mean. One day, for example, I took my laptop uh, to a computer repair shop. It was, uh, it was an Arabic-only situation. And I remember the verb that he used to uh, explain to me what he was going to do when he was, after he replaced my screen. I'd never used that word before, but because I knew the patterns and I knew the structure of the language, um, I knew what he was saying to me. When I came to the Kelsey Arabic program, then I was taught more than just vocabulary, more than just uh, colloquial phrases, I was taught the structure of the language here, the basic structure, so that um, I understand how it works, how, how's, how the language works. And that's something that the friends that I had weren't able to do for me and even in all my best efforts, I wasn't able to do for myself. I needed to sit in the classroom, listen to a teacher, tell me this is how the language works. Uh, to me, that's one of the biggest benefits of the uh, curriculum, the program uh, of Kelsey. Now that I speak Arabic, it's, it's fun. Uh, I can have conversations. I do know how to uh, engage people in a professional setting or in a personal setting. Uh, wherever I am, I feel confident that I can carry on a conversation as long as the conversation needs to go, um, thanks to my opportunity to study for two years here at the Kelsey Overbrook.